today's video we would create a testimonial section a neat and clean testimonial section using Avada theme and Avada builder every business uh, website every services website create a section on their website about the testimonial to show their visitors how the customers are satisfied and happy with their product and services as you can see on the screen a clean and gorgeous testimonial section is created we would create similar one uh, using Avada Builder so to do so let's proceed to the Avada Builder as you can see I have already opened the Avada Builder so first of all I would create uh, a title as you can see here a title what our customer says so add container here and the I'll use the one column section here so as you can see the plus icon add element I would add a title here just click the plus icon from here you can select any element according to your need if any element you cannot see on this screen just go to the search bar and write name to those uh, element so as I am going to use the title bar I am just write the title as you can see as I wrote title it is shown so I will click here our title is added so I would copy the content from this section just copy and paste here so as you can see our title is added you will see the two uh, thin lines are there at the right hand size it says let's remove them first to remove them you can see this is a general tab and with the journal tab you can see the design tab click here and come down to, to the bottom you can see the separator option here it is selected by default and I'll click here and choose the none you can see the two lines are removed just come to the top and click center you can see our title is center aligned after this as you can see this testimonial after this there is a text for this text I will add a text block for this just click on the plus icon and in the search bar write text you can see the text block it displayed click here and I will copy text from here just copy and paste here so when you will click double click here you can see this uh, option will appear and I am going to uh, make it center aligned just click here and you can see center aligned options and it is done so you can also choose a font family here font size here letter spacing and other things so let's give it one pixel as letter spacing so as you can see a little bit space between the text element and the title element so just click pencil icon on the title element and in the design tab you can see the top margin and bottom so uh, I'll give minus 25 uh, let's make it 20 as you can see it is now uh, spacing is removed after doing so I'll just just uh, hover over the uh, text element you can see the uh, plus icon just click here as you can see in this there is a icon I'll add icon here and in the search bar I'll type icon and just add here you can see a uh, title uh, sorry icon is added and let's format it when you come to the left hand side you can see the icon size is there you can increase or decrease the size of an icon so I am going to 
make it uh, let's make it 32 pixels and uh, you can come when you come down you can see the alignment let's make it center align so let's see you can see here it's uh, color is changed so let's change the color accordingly so when you'll come to the design tab of this uh, icon you can see the icon color from here uh, let's keep the icon color white and I'll change the background color when you click the background let's choose this one and also you can see the still we need to change the background border color it is uh, by default it is black when I will click here and uh, you can see it's changed so it is uh, yes this is the background border color and I'll change it here okay so let's see the similarity between the three build okay it's good now just we have to change the icon when you come to the general tab here you there are many icons you can choose from so I am just writing chat you can see many options are there related to the chat so I am going to use this one the similar one that I have shown to you after adding title and icon let's proceed and for this I would add a container just add container I am using two columns here so you can see two columns are added so just click add element and from there I'll choose the testimonial element just write testimonial into the search bar and the testimonial element is displayed just click on it you can see our testimonial element is added so you can see at the left hand side the two tabs children and this is the journal click journal in the journal tab you can see design option so there are two design classic one and the clean one so we would choose the clean one as you can see the clean one it shows the image as well after doing so let's back to the uh, children option and you can see the uh, a testimonial item just click the uh, edit item and you can see uh, click image and upload an image I have already uploaded so let's choose this one click insert you can see our image is added so uh, let's give it name James and company name AA consulting and I'll choose content from here just copy here and paste this one you can see the content is added so come back to this option and go to the general option in general option you can see the background color I'll choose the background color so let's choose the color okay it's look like this okay it's good after doing so just click the children uh, tab and from here you can uh, just clone the this uh, testimonial section for this you can see this option clone item click here the item is cloned just uh, change the names and the images so for this click edit item and click edit from there you will choose the image let's choose this one and change the name I am giving it name Mary and change the company HP marketing 
marketing home it is uh, added so as you can see our this column is created you can see uh, the images are changes randomly so here to add uh, separately to another column just click on this column let's see how we can do it just uh, hover over the uh, column you can see the column options from here you can see the clone column option just click here you can see our column is cloned now just change the names and the image and boom your testimonial would be done for this you can see the uh, edit option click here and click this one change the name like i am changing name to the mark and a consulting like software house like fast software house after doing so let's change the image click edit and i'll choose the this one and when you come back click the second option change the image so let's choose this one insert and change name like michel like soul restaurant you can give any name i am just giving whatever comes in mind so after doing so our testimonial section is almost done you can see so let's add when you'll come uh, the container option let's add a uh, margin top so let's add 50% so you can see our uh, testimonial section is added let's have a preview so as you can see our testimonial section is uh, added and you can see the images are random, randomly changing so this was all about the testimonial section in avada theme if you like this video please subscribe the channel for the more stunning videos like this thank you very much mm -hmm.